Yo! How is it going, guys? Welcome back to Ashtonir. If you guys remember this game, which you probably don't, months ago, like half a year ago or so, I played this on the channel, um, and we actually had gotten a little base set up. Um, I'll link the first video there, though it's really bad and pretty boring. So, yeah, you don't, you don't have to watch that if you don't want to. But I remember at the end of that episode, we had just finally managed to get a spaceship. I was thinking about heading into space. Since that time, there's actually been quite a few updates and I wanted to just check on things. Quite a few missions that I have to do and I don't quite remember where we left off. So I'm just gonna do things, start us up here. We have a thousand bites, which is not very much and I would like more of that. So I'll go out real quick and grab some bites over here with that the mission is now complete we now have some bites going um if you don't know what these are these allow us to research items that we can then craft i'm going to need a boost mod anyway because that's a challenge and we need zinc and to get zinc we need spalerite and there's also a mission to gather spalerite so i will probably also go do that wait is that it right here <laughs> well found it Okay, back on the surface, realized I was just accidentally recording in 30 frames, so hopefully things are slightly better. I'll claim this, it'll give me whatever this is. I'm not sure what that is. Uh, I think I'm going to want to put this somewhere slightly flat. I do not know if I can move this once I activate it, but we'll just have to yellow it and use. Yo, what in the world, bro? Why did you... I didn't ask for debris. Provide power to the Xen... Xenobiology lab. Eat. And it's not powered up. So I need to get this thing an oxy generator, and if I'm not mistaken, I could actually use a few oxy generators, one for my ship and such. So let me grab that, get this installed on here. Seems that it wants to go in this little cubby hole. Shove it in, open it up, boom, it's got oxygen. Use data log, data log, to activate Xenobiology Labs Tracker. Oh, oh, that's a lot of, a lot of text. I'm not gonna lie, I don't really want to read any of it. Okay, so currently, it seems that the mission is to find a bunch of shells. It could be anywhere. What is this? Oh, well, there we go. A few moments later. It gave us the terrarium, so here's that. Now it just needs a bounce vine seed. <laughs> Okay, so I think it was the seed, so I'll finally put that in there, and that part is done. Pretty sure I'm supposed to put that on there. Uh, <laughs> I don't think it was supposed to come out of that, but yeah. emo we don't no uh um, okay and i'm now doing the chicken dance for uh, yeah so i've now captured an animal fun he's probably just gonna stay there forever vegans come at me Alright, now we're gonna fly away. I'm just gonna launch to another planet. I think I have everything. So, yeah. I'm out of here. Very cool. So, I want to go to Kalidor. That's De Solo. I want to go to Kalidor first because this has better materials. Um, I also, when trying to find landing zones which are taking a second to load in here i want to hopefully find a landing zone that is very close to an obelisk that's not crazy far from an obelisk 
like this one right here that's like right next to an obelisk this is a good spot and look at that it's even a nice flat area we'll start by getting set up as you always do so that starts with a platform I already have the medium printer and I also have this field shelter so I'll put this down a useful little thing Boom. Produces half of you a second. Might as well use it. I'm gonna need to find some resin to make some more platforms to set up the base with. Because resin is the building block of all bases. Let's find a large platform B. Very nice. This doesn't have much energy. I can't really offer it much energy. I guess I can give it a QTRTG on there. Speed it up a little. I'm gonna craft a medium storage just for a little bit of space. Time to go down under. Oh, I found the Kalidor shell. One of them, anyway. Haha! -ha! Found two shells. Very good. Oh, there we go. I got a shell. I got all five. I need to head back to my tethers before I die of oxygen loss. I also need to remember where in the world my tethers are. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where were they? They were this direction, right? Please tell me they were this direction. Where are they? I don't know where they are. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm going to go look for a different metal real quick. What in the world are these? Ooh, is that what I'm looking for in the mountain? It's all the way at the top, though. How am I even supposed to get there? This is hard. I can't get up to the metal. Maybe if I did it at a slope like this. Aha! This is the way to do it. So now I can mine it easily. No! No, 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 I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. Ah, 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 my controller disconnected. You could, you could not have timed that worse. It's time to go home. I'm gonna take all these materials, put them on the smelter. It also wants me now to make a chemistry lab, which is a very handy dandy thing indeed. It's gonna need a ceramic, a glass, and a tungsten. I'm gonna need to go grab some quartz for some glass, because it doesn't seem that we have any of that. Now after forever, I have the glass, I have the tungsten, and the last ingredient is ceramic. Okay, the ceramic is done smelting, and now I can print the chemistry lab, which is a very important and handy dandy tool to have. Okay, chemistry lab complete. Very nice. I'll unpack this bad boy. Ah, it's beautiful. You can now craft advanced stuff, like really advanced stuff, like hardest thing to get in the game is a nanocarbon alloy. We're gonna need like gases for some of these. It it gets there's a lot of resources in this game. It gets very complicated. Well, I'll chuck this in, get a rubber. And that'll begin crafting. And what is that? A rubber. Quite interesting looking. So as it turns out, at that very exact moment, my recording cut off the ending. So I'm going to have to redo the outro, which, as always, Eli out.